next standard integral show that integral of 1 by a square plus x square dx equals to 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus c proof. Let x is equal to a tan theta. Differentiate both sides with respect to theta. So, d x by d theta. So, a tan theta derivative is secant square theta. d x is equal to a secant square theta d theta. Now, integral becomes i is equal to 1 by a square plus x square dx. Now, integral 1 by a square plus x square means a square tan square theta, dx means a secant square theta d theta. 1 by a square common 1 plus tan square theta into a secant square theta d theta the a, a, a cancel next 1 by a common integral 1 plus tan square theta is nothing but secant square theta 1 by secant square theta into secant square theta d theta so, this this gets cancelled. So, we have 1 by a integral d theta. Integral of d theta is theta. So, 1 by a theta. Now, what is the value of theta? Let us see. See, tan theta is equal to x by a. So, using this one, theta is equal to tan inverse x by a. So, this is equal to 1 by a tan inverse x by a plus c. So, now let us move to other standard integral. show that integral 1 by a square minus x square dx is equal to 1 by 2 a log of mod a plus x by a minus x plus c. Now, proof. First, we have to find out partial fractions of 1 by a square minus x square. So, 1 by a square minus x square is equal to 1 by a minus x into a plus x. Now, if we add these two, what do you get to a? So, that means this we can write 1 by 2 a times a plus x plus a minus x by a minus x and a plus x. This is 1 by 2 a times a plus x by a minus x into a plus x means 1 by a minus x plus 1 by a plus x. Now, integral i is equal to integral of this 1 by 2 a common 1 by a plus x plus 1 by a minus x dx. Now, 
1 by 2a integral of 1 by a plus x dx and next minus integral of minus 1 by a minus x dx right down. See already we have studied the methods of substitution derivative of a plus x is 1 f dash x by f of x. So, log f of x a minus x differentiation is minus 1. So, f dash x by f of x. So, using this formula integral f dash x by f of x dx is equal to log of mod f of x plus constant of integration. So, we write 1 by 2 a of log mod a plus x minus log mod a minus x. So, in logarithms already we have studied formulae log x minus log y means log x of x by y. So, this can be written 1 by 2 a log of mod a plus x by a minus x plus constant of integration. So, next let us move to the next one. Show that integral of 1 by x square minus a square dx is equal to 1 by 2 a log of mod x minus a by x plus a plus c. Now, solution. Let us find out partial fractions of 1 by x square minus a square. 1 by x square minus a square is equal to 1 by x plus a into x minus a. If you subtract x minus a from x plus a, you get 2a. So, we write 1 by 2a times x plus a minus x minus a by x plus a into x minus a. Now, this can be written 1 by 2 a of 1 by x minus a minus 1 by x plus a. Now, integral i is equal to 1 by 2 a integral of 1 by x minus a dx minus integral of 1 by x plus a dx. Derivative of x minus a is 1 f dash x by f of x. Derivative of x plus y a is also 1. So, formula integral f dash x by f of x dx is log mod f of x. So, this is equal to 1 by 2 a log mod x minus a minus log mod x plus a. This is 1 by 2 a times log of mod x minus a by x plus a plus c. So, that means using trigonometric substitutions and using partial fractions we can find out some st standard integrals. So, standard integrals means integral of 1 by root of a square minus x square, integral of 1 by root of x square minus a square, integral of 1 by root of a square plus x square, integral of 1 by a square plus x square, integral of 1 by a square minus x square, and integral of 1 by x square minus a square dx. These are all called standard integrals. So, 
in the next class we discuss problems on the methods of substitutions.